For question two, how does the top equation relate to the bottom equation? Well, it looks like it's not only flipped, but it looks like it's cut in half. So again, the um, stuff that's over here on the reactants ends up on the products side. And then instead of there being two ammonias, there's only one ammonia there. So it looks like it has been flipped and it has been cut in half. So if that's the case, then um, when you flip it, you invert it, take it to the negative one, and then when you cut it in half, you raise it to the um, stoichiometric equivalent uh, that you did. So you'd be raising it to the one half. So um, you would essentially then be taking Kc, and it would, which would be 2.7 times 10 to the negative fourth, and you'd be raising it to the negative one half. So if all you did was cut it in half, you'd be taking the square root of it, which is the one half, but then because you flipped it as well, you have to invert it. That raises it to the negative one exponent, so it ends up being 2.7 times 10 to the negative fourth to the negative one half. So this is 2.7 times 10 to the negative fourth raised to the negative 0.5. I'm getting about 61 or so, uh, which is that guy there when you do it.